I was born and raised in the jungle in Sabai. Five years old, my dad started teaching me how to make the fire, rubbing the sticks together. That's the method. I know you have your own method. So while you flick your pick, we rub our stick. It takes five hours, rainy days we don't eat. Then we go to McDonald's <laughs> and eat chicken nuggets. The wood must be very dry, the two pieces got to be the same. Because of the friction, we're going to use the same wood. The important part, when you start rubbing, please don't rush it. Because it makes you tired. Rub slow in the beginning until you see the smoke, then you pick up the speed. On the Survivor show, they didn't slow down. In the beginning, they went like that. As soon as they started smoking, they stopped because their arms tired. I scream at the TV, try to tell them what to do. Nobody listened to me. So I just bought another TV. The beginning of time. When you rub the sticks, don't rub too close where you're sitting. You lean forward. We add a little weight from your upper body to your hands. It will help. You shape the little piece into about a quarter of an inch. Because if it's too wide, you'll spend more time warming a lot of space down here. It's like running a race. Four hundred meter race begin. Three hundred meters left, same speed. It's about halfway we start picking up the speed. The last 50 meters of the race is when you get to go for it. In seconds, fire is burning in the wood like that. Go get the matches. <laughs> I, I hate this job. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Here it comes. Huh? Come on, baby. <laughs> Transfer the burning particles to the dry has the coconut. It's flammable and it catches fire very easily.